Are you just judging me based off my looks? You are strong. I guess there's no judging people by their appearance. You learned a valuable life lesson. You should take this forward with you. Oh, what? Oh, if I actually went into this part of the city as a cutscene. Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It's time for the under time again today. Without further ado, let's bring out the special summon we've all been waiting for. Lady Venus, please. Hi everyone, it's me, your Venus. Everybody's Venus, everyone's Venus, that's me. I have something terribly important to share with you today. It's horrid. There are spies right here in the under. Can you imagine? We don't really know all the details, but if you see anyone suspicious, please let us know. Everyone, please, I'm counting on you. We need you to get lots of information for us. And that was Lady Venus, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Thank you for watching. Please do tune in again. There be spies around. No way! They know we came here already? Well, don't just talk it out. Don't just tell everyone. Jason, we're going to have to be cautious. Hey, the spies that snuck into the under. It's gotta be you, am I right? Or am I right? Yes. Hmm, if you're really spies, you wouldn't admit that you are, would you? Yes. Never. I, wasn't, I didn't want a free Pokemon battle. What's in the old shop? The old shoppy. I was thinking, the guy next to me is browsing. I think he's a spy. Shh, don't stare at that guy. Hi. The kid next to me keeps checking me out. It's distracting. Am I that cool or what? Ah, none of you are cool. What do you have? Do you have any contraband? Oh, you have some TMs. A vicious snow and wind attack that may freeze a foe. Is that the power of the snow that keeps freezing me? That's Hyper Beam. Oh, uh, that was the light screen. Negates all damage. Let's protect. Prevents any stats. Prevents stats of abnormality with a mystical power. Strike that target with a thunderbolt. Strikes the target with a thunderbolt. It may paralyze. Is that actually thunderbolt? Damn, that'd be useful to pick up. Creates a wall of light that weakens physical attacks. A powerful fire attack that may burn the target. Is that flamethrower? He's got some nice stuff here. The attack power varies among different Pokemon. I have to come back here. He's got some useful TMs, and some of them might actually be useful to use on my team. Do you have time to hear an old man's tale? No. What? Young people these days have no patience, always in a rush. Well, fine. I'll be in a rush too. Okay. You're, you're right there, old man. You're just you're kind of having a seizure. Rush, rush, rush. Ah! I broke the old man. This is all your fault. Lady Venus is the unders. No, she's my idol. For Lady Venus, I could do anything. But even though I'm so near to her, I've not seen even a glimpse of her in person. Oh, it hurts deeply. Lady Venus! Wow. Um, you broke. The old man is broken. Just leave him be to calm down. If it's the Colosseum that you're wanting to go to, you can ride that UFO there. You do have the operating discs, right? I have that U disc. Alright, then there's no problem, is there? I guess we could go forward on that thing. The U disc goes. Was it, was it a U disc or F disc? I think it's F disc, which is forward. Hmm, weird. There seems to be nothing broken here. Yeah. What's the hold up? It should be here by now. What should be here by now? The package? So I've got your package right here. Uh, what do you want, muscle lady? Did you hear? This cypher admin's named Dakim was beaten down. That's the second admin to go down after Mira B. The enemy must be pretty strong. I don't mean to brag, but I, th I think he's a pretty strong guy. Three hype potions? Sweet. Have a little explore around the under. Under trip. What do you have? The underground hotel. For a thousand 
dollars. That's a rip off. A hundred was alright. A thousand. What's this? Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It's time for the under time again. Lady Venus, please. Hi everyone, it's me, your Venus. Everybody's Venus, that's me. That's, that's her intro, I guess. I'm very disappointed the spies haven't been caught yet. Can you imagine? It's been like five minutes. Everyone, please, I'm counting on you for more cooperation. And that was Lady Venus, ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls, thank you for watching. Please do tune in again. Okay, so here's the plan. If I spot a spy, what I'll do is clear the area, then shout really loudly to start the spy. Whilst the spy is startled, you jump and subdue him. How's that for a plan? Hmm? What do you two want? We're having an important chat here. Leave us alone here. I find Venus repugnant. Repugnant. I can't stand that type of cheap coyness in anyone. What is it with that I'm your Venus shtick? It's revolting. I'm with you, old man. Oh, she's my Venus. I'm with you, old man. She's a bit... She's a bit of a brainwasher. <laughs> My partner's the brains of us two. His plans always work. But you know, I always seem to be the one getting hurt all the time. That's because she's the big beefy guy. And he's a hunter. Because... You can tell because of his clothes. Now I'm judging people based on their appearance. But it's true. Alright, what do you have to say, roller skater kid? Hey, spies! I see spies! Spies! Oh, wait. That can't be right. Real spies would look much stronger. Sorry, my mistake. A lot of people seem to judge people on their appearance here. It's very wrong. But you shouldn't be doing that. Hello. The winner of a Coliseum challenge gets to meet Lady Venus in person and receive a shadow Pokemon. One day, I'm going to end there and get me a shadow Pokemon. Before that, I'll test the opposition, starting with you. Here he goes. Chase a Gurx. Chase a Gurx. Magikarp and Phoebus. Best of luck to you in the Coliseum. That's all I can say. Because you're not going to have the biggest shot of those Pokemon. Right, I think we should focus down the Phoebus first because it can use attacks on like Magikarp. Kill the Phoebus. Nice job. Magikarp's faster. Oh no. This is why we're targeting the Phoebus. Because it knows attacks. And that's bad. Use Fly, Noctowl, avoid the splash. It's probably both of the Pokemon are faster than me. Die, fishy. Oh, I'm gonna eat you, little fish. Oh, Magikarp knows an attack. No! It done pathetic damage anyway. I know Magikarp can learn attack. Oh, that's using Splash now. You might want to work on your moveset there, buddy. Using Splash is probably not the best strategy. Even though it may have some, like, secret hidden awesomeness. No one has discovered this yet, so whale lord. That's bigger than a magic art. I think we know what our new threat is. Whale lord. That has a lot of health. Whale lord. Fight the whale lord. Is that thing just using splash? It's bird to sleep. Damn it. Try. Nope, surf. That's bad. That thing is massive. The wave just kind of goes through it. It's funny they appear whale lord in this game. They've actually like scaled it up. The massive whale thing. This is taking too long. All right, knocked out. We need to bring in the instant kill of Ampharos and zap that whale. And bite the magic heart. Because that's just. We're gonna have to kill it and it's getting in my way. Go on, Ampharos. By getting in my way, it's using Splash, but it has a health bar and it must die. 
Bye, Magical. Ooh, faint attack. Draws the target close and strikes without fail. So it's bite, except it can't miss. Instead of. It will never miss. But I kind of prefer bite because it has the flinch chance and. There's not too many situations where you'll be screwed over by using that 100 accuracy attack instead of your pain attack. And there are a few situations if your accuracy gets shafted over or they spam evasion. But besides that, get Thunderbolted. But besides that, you know, the flinch is so much more valuable. Well, the Ray Umbreon is, he needs those flinches rather than the. He needs flinches rather than the. I always hit with these attacks. His attack isn't that high. I'll never become the champ if I'm losing here. You might want to evolve that magic up and then your team will be a bit more beefy. Ah, shoot. I'm not giving up until I win at the Coliseum and get me a Shadow Pokemon of my own. Would you like to see my Shadow Pokemon? It's a fire dog. I tell you, this mean I'm the spy. Dakin totally didn't have that Pokemon. Shut up. When the under used to be a mining town, the junk shop's owner used to be the train driver. But where's all this railway supposed to be in the under? I've never seen it. It appears my grandchild recently joined something called the Kids Grid. Since then, I get this feeling that parts have been slowly disappearing from the shop. What's that troublemaker doing? She get a talk to, stern talking to. Hello. Oh sheesh, what should I do? I have to make a delivery, but I'm still not done cleaning. Hey wait, wow, aren't you Jason and Bob? How do you know us? Huh? How do you know who we are? That was exactly my thought, Bob. I thought so. This makes things easy. Please, can I get you to deliver this part to Nets house? I'm not your delivery boy. Apparently I am, because I just obtained the power-up part. But, wait. Just tell Net that this is from Pear. He'll tell you the details. Nets house is the one with the big rotating antenna dish. You'll know which one it is as soon as you see it. Yeah, I saw that earlier. There wasn't much going on over there. But if I tell them about pet. Oh. Venus. What is your situation? Well, a couple of mice appear to be running loose, Nesco. But it's nothing to worry about. We'll catch them right away. Pulverize and mash them up. <laughs> Fine. The priority is to distribute Shadow Pokemon. Don't forget. As for you, even. Hurry, complete the Shadow Pokemon's development as soon as possible. Your trust will not be misplaced, Master Nascur. Already, sufficient Shadow Pokemon battle data has been gathered from our minions. My masterpiece, the most powerful Shadow Pokemon in history, shall soon be ready. Soon be ready! Soon. Good. I'll be waiting for the good news, that is all. Now, it is time we return to the lab and put on the finishing touches. Come, back to the lab. Yes, sir. You need to, like, brush that hair down, mate. It's a bit pokey outy. I mean, I've had those stray hairs that sort of poke up, but that's a bit off the charts. Alright then. That was some interesting information we learned for our psychic vision. Guess we gotta stop them because master plan is sounds pretty bad. Alright, what have you got to say? You brought me the power up from pair? Power up part from pair? Great, I was waiting for that. Huh? Are you? Are you? The? Jason and Bob? Oh wow, this is too awesome. Come on, you have to get inside. Quick, quick. What 
we gonna do here? Meg! Net! You won't believe who just stopped dropped in for a visit. We got some shocking company. Yep. Shocking company? Try not to be too shocked when you hear it. It's Jason and Bob. No! Really? Bit, is that true? Is that Jason really here? <laughs> See for yourself. Hello. Hi, I'm Net. Sec in Pirate Town told me about what you've been doing so far. Oh, this is from Pear. Great. This is all I needed to get the kids' grid back up and running again. Hey, you little tech wizard, are you? I better explain. A little while ago, we somehow lost access to the kids' grid. We think it's caused by a jamming signal that's interfering with the kids' grid. It's probably Venus is doing. But this power-up part you delivered will let me boost up our equipment. When we get the kids' grid back up, I'll try to hack their computers for useful data. Pretty sweet. Especially for a ten-year-old, whatever you are. My big brother Ned managed to get a little bit of data out of Cypher's computers. The data says there is a lab somewhere that makes shadow Pokemon. What, as in Mystery Lab? Alright then. Net is a genius, he's been gathering all sorts of data on those crooks. But anything else you can say? Okay then, I guess that's it. Guess I'll be going. Cool. Oh Jason, wait, please. I'll just talk to you. May I have your PDA number? We'll contact you just as soon as we discover anything. Mm, I'm not sure if we should be able to be giving my number out to kids. Whatever. Thank you. We'll do our best to gather useful information for you. What, what now? The spy. We've spotted the spy. Oh shit. The spy? Where? Where? Ooh. What are you free on about? Why are you free here now? Spy! I saw a spy. I got I got to thinking it may be you folks were the spies, but I see you've been barking up the wrong tree. <laughs> oh, so it's not us. Look over there. In front of the elevator, we've finally found the spy. Oh, this elevator here? Oh. Gah! Let me go! Let me go! Shut up! It's hopeless. Quick struggling. Kindly cooperate. Now you be a good boy. Lie still. That be silver. What are you doing, silver? 